guys welcome back to another update um let me kind of fill you guys in as to what's going on and where my focus is um as i told you guys from the previous video that i would be um that the goal was to come and just kind of funnel in through here and the main objective was to get that capital um so we worked our way through and now um, I'm on the way to that capital so I want you guys to see this because um, I'm anticipating a couple million dollars what y'all think let's guess guys let's, let's do this thing now a bruzo he owns all of this guys I mean this is a lot of provinces and all of these provinces generate money so I was, I, I just, the most important thing on my agenda was getting this capital. I don't know what everybody else was thinking about, but I couldn't even let everybody know what I was doing because I had to really, really push to get over here to get through this uh, situation here, all the way through here. And now we are 12 minutes away from the capital. So I'm going to let you guys enjoy this. We're going to see how much money is in the capital that we're about to acquire. Uh, this is this is exclusive footage right here because you don't generally get to see a situation where somebody was uh, cheating, using all their money to get gold and get a provinces. And he acquired over five. How do you get over 500 something provinces in less than 30 days? That's crazy. And so that's a lot of money that he generated. So I want you guys to get the opportunity to see exactly what happens, how much money he had um, stored up. And I'm thinking, you know, while we're talking about it, that he I don't know if the computer uh, spends a lot of money. But if the computer has not been spending a lot of money, I mean, guys, it's an unlimited amount of money. That should be sitting at that capital. I can't wait to see what the prize is, guys. Now, I want y'all to comment for me how much y'all think is in this capital. That's what I want to know. <laughs> I should cut it short. <laughs> I should cut this thing short and not let y'all see it to the next video. But I ain't going to do y'all like that. I'm not going to do y'all like that. I'm going to let y'all see how much money is in this capital. Now, let me tell you something else about this. I don't want to waste no time. Um, I don't want nobody popping up over here at this time. Even though I'm not worried about it, I got my airplanes ready to go if anybody does pop up. But uh, what you can do to just get there a little quicker in these moments, you see I got 10 minutes and 30 seconds left. At the five minute mark, I can go ahead and stop and it will go ahead and take that province. All right. So we got about five minutes. So during these five minutes, let me just look around and let's talk about some of the other things that I had concerns about. Um, as you can see, my coalition members are starting to funnel in through here and get that and get these provinces rolling. Um, my 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 next thing, guys, I'm gonna be honest with you, is just burning in my in my heart a little bit. Is this guy right here, West Raj Putana? I don't know why I just feel like he rubbed me the wrong way with this situation here. And I've always felt like he was watching our coalition and watching what we were doing, seeing how we were battling um, a Bruzo. And I believe he was probably trying to find a way to kind of backdoor us while we were dealing with the Bruzo. But his plans fell flat because when a, Bru a Bruzo got banned, I think that threw his whole little agenda off. Because as you can see, he was already moving troops over here where I'm at. And now I'm asking you to let's just trade. Why would you want to be in the middle of somebody's um, nation right here? So I asked you to trade. I was going to give him this spot here for this one. And he didn't want to do that. And so um, and it's not about the resources, meaning he's, he's telling me it's because he wants the oil versus the grain. I don't buy that for one second. 
Um, I think you just want to be disruptive to what I'm trying to do. And so with that being said, I think Wes Rajputana will be my next agenda as far as seeing what he's trying to do and um, dealing with that that coalition over here. Um, I, I was already attacked by his coalition member, Wes Madras. Is that his name? Let me see what his name is. Uh, yeah, I was already attacked by uh, South Madras. So... They have already showed aggression towards us over here in Africa. So once we close this out, um, we need to keep in mind Rash Putana and his coalition over here. I think he's feeling some kind of way about the fact that we have benefited and we have progressed. Even though we were being cheated and we took the brunt of the damage from Abruzzo. I think a lot of these other nations are upset because we took advantage of the situation and we're doing well now. Um, they're really going to hate when they see that this capital is gone. So we got seven minutes to go. We'll stop it at the five minute mark. Very, very, very important part of this game, guys. This is a game changing situation. These are the type of things you have to do when you call yourself a general, when you call yourself a master in this game, when you call yourself a leader in this game. This is what it's about. Can you make these type of moves? You know, so I'm glad to show you guys the steps that it took. I had to be very still. Um, you know, it's not just easy to just creep up and do, you know, and just go and creep up on somebody's capital. It has to be some calculation. Um, you know, you just got to know what you're doing. And these are the things that I don't show you every single thing that I do, but I try to give you a, a general blueprint. As to how it's done and how you can win without having to cheat and spend a bunch of money and um, using multiple accounts. This is one account. You don't need to do all that. It's no fun in that. It's a lot of fun when you can come together with your team like we have done here. And now we have the whole continent of Africa. Very, very, very important. We have the Lord. We have we have the whole continent. And now we can we can move forward. And, um, man, we're going to try to go ahead and win this map. Uh, another good thing about taking that capital is I can take all of my men now that's been sitting around here and I can move them on out because I don't have to worry about um, areas where um, I don't have to worry about this situation where an uprising and revolts. So that would eliminate all of these revolts. All right. So let's check it out. Let's see where we at. I think it's about that time. Yeah, I'm excited, y'all. This is the part of the game that we that we that we sometimes stay up at night for. You know what I mean? This is that. This is it. This is what we this is what we play for. All right. So let's go ahead. All right, man. I'm 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 hoping for ten million. I'm hoping for ten million at least. If I don't get ten million, you know, I won't be too disappointed. But that's what I'm hoping for. All right. So let's do it. Here we go. Let's see what we got. And like I said, we're at the five minute mark. So once you stop at the five minute mark, you're good. What I tell y'all. What I tell y'all. <laughs> what I tell y'all. I told y'all, didn't I? <laughs> Man, do y'all see that money? Let me see something. How much did he give me up? $12 million, people. Is what I just took from old Abruzzo over here. Twelve million dollars. All right. So um, let's go ahead and. Wow, that's crazy. And you know what I'm going to do? I had asked the Marlin. Well, let me not speak too soon. Let me not speak too soon. But there you have it, guys. I got $12 million in my account and all my provinces now are secure, meaning I don't have to worry about a revolt or anything of that nature. So everybody should be clear. Perfect. I don't have to use anything to upgrade these uh, morale on the provinces. Perfect. All over here. I can move all my soldiers on now. 
because all of this should be cleared up now by taking that taking that capital so we're good to go guys I have just put myself in a very powerful position now in this game so we're gonna we're gonna buy some resources build some stuff up and we're gonna try to uh, help the rest of my team build their team up at this stage I'm just gonna let I want my team I'm, now it's a team game now I want my team to take advantage of the, this opportunity to come on in I will not be as aggressive as I was this was the mission um, and this is mission accomplished um, this is how you do it guys so you want to see the steps and you know everything just go back to the, the previous videos before this one and it'll show you all the steps that it took to get to this point all right appreciate y'all watching I will keep y'all updated okay subscribe um, like the video if you have any questions by all means ask any questions that you may have um, and I'll see you guys next time